Hey yo together and very welcome to the Stock of Two Crazy Replays today with the TVP on Terraform Ladder Edition. I have to hurry up the heck out of here because, um, yeah, StarCraft 2 will get an update, uh, patch 3.0, and with that patch I'm not any longer allowed, it's not able to watch all the replays anymore if this patch goes live and I have like 20 more games to cast, I'm not quite sure, a lot of ca games to cast, so I have to hurry up. So here we are on Terraform Ladder Edition spawning in the Left top position as the blue Protoss playing for Team AG, it's Jinzes. Ooh. With a sneaky pro, as you can see here. And he's playing against me, the red Terran spawning in the right bottom position, it's Alexasher. So, there we go. Proxy pilot for Jinzes, alright. Yeah, okay, I see that. Most likely proxy gateway. And that position is. yeah. You can go for that. Uh, I'm scouting a little bit for the main base, but not everything because I want to have the barracks in time. So there are a bit uh, some some small weak spots where he could have dropped the pylon as well. But he's going for the double gateway at my natural. And this is fine. This build is very strong. Uh, you're cutting probes a little bit, but the damage you can deal with that is huge. Uh, you can deal game-ending damage. Uh, the problem is the probe is too early, so I'm like, wait a second, this probe is a bit too early. Because normally it just enters the base when the barracks is almost done, like now. But it's not too suspicious. The good thing is I'm scouting with the foreign scout SCV, my natural. Oh yeah, and that's exactly the case why I'm doing this. I mean, one out of... Oh, the pylon. Ooh, so annoying, I can't throw down a bunker right there. This is huge. And the probe super annoying. I need to wall off. The cellar has been chrono boosted out. More and more SCVs are coming off the line. Uh, there's a bunker, but there is... Ah, it's, it's difficult. He's harassing with this probe. Uh, I won't get the pylon in time. Uh, there's a bunker. Ooh, there we go. The probe goes down. Uh, but the bunker... Oh, that's that's very close. It's taking so much damage. It's not being constructed constructed fast fast enough. So I guess it will fall. Oh, the bunker! Uh, no cancel! And now three salads versus two... No, versus one marine and a bunch of SCVs. Oh, chasing that one back. Killing so many SCVs already behind that. He's not probing. Uh, focus fire not too good here. No focus fire at all. Seven SCVs went down so far, that's huge! Uh, no, 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 don't lose all the SCVs! Oh, <laughs> 10 SCVs lost in total! So I'm down to 7 now. Uh, I could have microed way better. Uh, the bunker will finish now. Oh, don't shoot the pylon! The, no, 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 no! If the pylon goes down, then there's an entrance into my main base again. Yeah, ooh, now I realize. Yeah, <laughs> that's. That's very difficult, a very difficult situation. Behind that, he's taking gas and most likely thrown down a cybernetics core very soon. A pylon goes down, but supply depot is being constructed there. We have a Reaper so that I can finally scout. Uh, 10 SCVs against 14 probes. I'm ahead in income a little bit. Uh, this guy trash talking. Trash talking, Jinzes. Please stop it. Uh, yeah, I guess I will throw down a command center soon. Oh, he goes in, sees a lot of trouble and backs off. Yeah, there we go, command center there. Uh, the income with the mule is looking good for me. Uh, I guess I will, yeah, resaturate the gas, very important. There's a probe, I might get it. Oh, that's very nice, getting a probe here. Uh, very important. And there's nothing back at home. The mothership core is being chrono boosted out, so let's see how much damage this reaper will find there. Oh god, are you serious Jinzes? Okay, salads are on their way back. So far this reaper got three kills. There will be a fourth one most likely. Ah! Yeah, I should get it. There we go. And, ooh, my... Ah, no, 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 no. Don't wanna lose the reaper. But I put... Okay, three salads making their way back. Okay, there's one salad here. And we see the reactor on my uh, barracks. 
So this Reaper can potentially kite for days against this salad as long as the mothership goes out of position. So we see Cybernetics is researching the warp gate and we see a Twilight Council behind that. Oh god. So this is this can be Blink follow up or Dark Templar. The problem is there are two gateways in the front here at the natural. So if he loses the pylon, those are useless and he will be forced to remake them. Uh, which is not very good. Uh, the Reaper can kite here as I said for days. But again, three salads it will take this one a very long time until he kills a salad. Especially when the shield is gone, look at that. Just six armor, uh, six damage for each double shot. So, yeah, it, it takes a long time and the shields can recharge again. So, that would be a good multitasking challenge. Uh, keep your Reaper alive and kill like ten salads with focus fire and stuff like that while you're behind muckering. It's just really difficult, as you can see, I, I'm not doing anything here. Uh, very difficult. So the Marines are coming down. Dark Templar Shrine. So Dark Shrine here. You see some Dark Templar. I might lose a Marine there. Oh, that was unnecessary. No GM Master League, uh, G Grand Master League. Uh, micro here. <laughs> as well as the failed rally point. You can see this guy is keeping me really busy here. Uh, with all that stuff. But there we go. He loses the pylon, those gateways useless and he has to remake them. Still on one base at the 9 minute mark. He got a photon overcharge available, which is good, but also no proxy pylon yet. He's sending out probes. Finally, oh no, that's a salad. Mm, not a Caesar salad, but a salad. You get it? <laughs> oh, I'm so funny. Ah, he gets an SV. No! He doesn't get SV. Oh, big blunder there. Ooh, running around in circles. And this one gets down for sure without any kill. Oh, so unlucky. But there's a proxy pylon, so DTs are a possibility. I got two scans available, which is very good. But, throwing on the mules already, oh no. Uh, the gateways are finishing up. Needs to open them first. There we go, Dark Templar. Oh, I got nothing there. I got Widow Mines and such, but... Uh, okay, there's no wall. Uh, yeah. Okay, first DT there. Second one at the net. I saw it. I guess I saw it. eBay is thrown down immediately, but he will cancel it or at least delay it, most likely. Dark Templar dealing a lot of damage. So 19, 20 kills in total. Six already on that one. Five on that one. Uh, I got a scan. Scan is ready. There's one Dark Templar here. I might scan. Okay, one Dark Templar goes down. Where's the second one? I lost track of... Oh, two more there, okay. So he's working on that <coughs> refinery. Uh, sending one DT to bait out the scan. DT is still making a lot of damage. Oh, 10 kills, are you kidding me? So I'm down to 18 SCVs now. Turret can finally be made. Uh, but the Dark Templar goes in. There's no detection. Raven pops! Woo! Raven hype! So the Raven again saving me here. And the Widow Mine gets the lucky shot and the kill. Okay, so next is finally 12 minute expand for Jinzas here. And there's a photon cannon, so he saw the Widow Mines, he knows, okay, I need detection against that. And it looks like I might be able to finally drop those. So I'm down. Yeah, he, he dealt a lot of damage, but with the mules, it should be quite equal in income soon. Uh, I'm harvesting a lot of gas as I'm playing, of course, mech again, as it looks like. Uh, warping in a Dark Templar, that's not gonna work. No, that was... Mm, yeah, he sees the Widow my there, he knows there's a turret. Goes in and dies. So here we have to drop Medivac on the way. Boosting. And so far just 5 worker kills. Ah, backing off, okay. Not gonna commit to that yet. Maybe with the boost. Maybe as soon as the boost is ready, there we go. Boost is ready. Dropping one, dropping two. Oh! Okay, three kills on that one. Not the most amazing shot, but it is okay. I'm ahead in Verka and I got double mule, so that's very, very good for me. Ah, patrolling just in case of a warp prison, which can happen, of course, again. Uh, it, ha it didn't happen this game, but it happened a lot to me lately. War Prison harassment is really strong. Especially in Legacy of the Void, you see, Adept War Prison all day long. All day long. It's really annoying. 
Uh, it looks like I'm moving out. Yeah, there's the raven. He sees it with the pylon, so he should be ready to prepare. Oh, two cannons and one archon as well as the nexus cannon. So that might work. Need to be careful not to lose the observer because the raven will be there for the detection to kill it. But bit of mind, not too good if there's detection. Cannons, really strong. Those marines have no upgrades, but there is one tank. Uh, ah, yeah, there we go. War prison. Told you. Uh, okay, Jinz's eco is very low. Ah, oh, double cannons. Carefully. I got a medevac here. Photon overcharged use. But I don't need to throw on the PTD yet. Because first of all I need to kill those cannons. Bam! There we go. So those cannons just buy him a little bit of time. And I feel like the photon overcharge was used too early. So it will fade out without doing nothing. There's a bunch of Dark Templar here. Mm, he's not using them currently. He would love to take out the Raven so he can work with the DTs, but... Ah, there we go. Oh, the War Prison! Running into the Viking! Oh! So, Photon Overcharge being used a second time. There we go. Dark Templar. A second Viking, so he will lose that one. Uh, tanks. So, PDD very good. Soaking up a lot of damage. Archon Falls without doing anything. Uh, the Dark Templar dealing some damage here. Being very annoying. Working on the factory. Uh, the action is on, guys. Scan goes down, trying to kill them with the SCVs. What? That, that doesn't work. Uh, the tank might be helpful, but this Dark Templar still lives. And the factory is very low. Might die even before the uh, Widowmine finishes. Oh, this immortal. Gonna kill a double auto turret. Oh, the shield is gone already. Dark Templar falls. It's so close. Factory is getting repaired. Ah, uh, that one Dark Templar. It dies to the Viking. Widomai takes out that one, and I guess I've done it very close, but in the end this viking, pew pew, shooting at the nexus. Uh, he's throwing down a pile in there, most likely for cannons, but Jin is so far behind, I don't think that he can win anymore, not not really. Uh, there's a stalker, oh there we go, need to be very carefully, because there are Widomites, oh he's running into salads, ooh. And I'm saving that one and the Viking most likely after taking out the salad. Nice. And look at that. There's no animation for the Viking to pop out. Bam, it's just there. See? Because the development team never thought like, oh, you could drop Vikings out of a medivac. But no, but does that. Wrong, I did it. So please fix that for Legacy of the Void. Uh, Jinsus holds strong for now. I don't know what he's spending like 200 APM with this low eco, but okay. Uh, yeah, but army supply wise, <laughs> look at that, it's not gonna work. And Vikings are really good against, gate, uh, against gateway units. Oh, the Widowmines, friendly fire incoming, oh goodness, there's an auto turret again. And the Immortal, very good against those tanks and against the Viking, but the combined firepower is just a little bit too much here. Oh, look at the damage, Rums. oh he got plus one attack, this is really helpful. That is, that is good. So, oh, bit of mine. Oh, no, now the shields are gone. And bye bye, immortal, you're so low. Ah, payback time, baby. And there we go. Pulling the probes into the bit mines. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be a good explosion. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there you go. GG. What a funny game. Yeah, this is... So normally you would have loved to not lose 10 SCVs to this push, to this aggression. Uh, you can, what I, what I should have done is have one SCV there uh, with on hold position and repair with two others, that one, and do this as long as possible, pull back before it dies, stuff like that. Or just pull back here with the surround before they die, but, yeah, but against three salads it's really difficult. So yeah, that's that's that. But in the end, it didn't matter. The DTs were nice. The Raven saved me this time. So glad I got this Raven, man. Ooh, wow. And yeah, that's how you could try to defend this. It wasn't really good. I lost a lot of SCVs, but as you can see, you, you can lose a lot of SCVs with the double orbital command and still be equal. Or maybe even a bit ahead. It's, it's possible. So don't, don't rage quit at minute 3 if you're losing a bunch of SCVs. It's nothing lost, you can still win. 
So that's that. I'm gonna go cast the next game because I have to hurry up. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I wish you a very nice day and...